Well, here we've got a problem involving the use of a graphics calculator. If you haven't want to use one of these before, then uh, there's a, it's a lot of functions in them, and uh, they can be quite complex to use. So we'll just go bit by bit through the year and adding new functions as we go. Any of you are experts, that's fine. You can teach me a few things too, because I've just been learning for the last uh, year or so. So I can do some stuff on it, but there's still a lot I don't know. So let's have a little look at uh, how you use this for this problem. Now let's look at the problem first. So we're using a graphics calculator to plot the following linear graphs on the same axis, axes and then comment on them. So we've got question A, a series of graphs which we have to insert and then graph them. B, a different series of graphs and so forth. So let's just look at this first one here and how you'll go about it. First thing, let's turn the calculator on. So we press the on button and there we go. Now we want to input these graphs, so where would we go for that? So they're all y equals something. So notice here we've got a y equals. So we access that because of the colour coding there. We access that for the button, it's the same colour. So here we go here and then press that. And now we've got a series of graphs which are all uh, y equals. Goodness me, it's noisy in here. So here now I need to input equals what? Well, the first thing was y equals 2x. So we've got 2x, so let's input the 2x, and then press enter, and now you notice it's jumped up here. So our first function has been inserted. Next one, 2x plus 1. So 2 is the x plus 1, enter. Next one, 2x plus 2, then there's 2x plus 3, 2x plus 4. So that's all the ones here. So it's 2x plus 2, so the next one equals I'll enter 2x plus 3, enter, and 2x plus 4, enter. So there's all our graphs, uh, enter our relationships, enter there. Well, there are five different graphs. Now we're going to actually your functions. Now we're going to draw the graphs. So there we go, the graph function. Again, it's that blue color. So we access it by clicking here first to select that and the graph. And it will draw them automatically for us. So there's the first one, y equals 2x. The next one, y equals 2x plus 1 and 2 and 3 um, and so on. So there's all our graphs. We could expand here using the, the zoom control if we want to. I'm not going to bother about it now. What can we say about them? Comment on them, it says. Well, pretty obviously they're all parallel to each other. And why is that? Well, look here. Notice it's 2x, 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 2x. So they all have the same gradient. So you'd expect them to be parallel if they had the same gradient, would you not? Is that going to be the case with the next one? Um, could be not. What do you think? I'll leave that one for you to do.